speaking of fun, hello again to you three. Fuck, mate, we didn't really speak to you three, but we kind of got the gist just by looking at you, didn't we? Uh, what's, what's the deal with you, Ralph Lauren? What's, what's going on? Right, right, let's make this... I'm just, I'm speaking to you out of courtesy more than anything else, because you seem like nice lads, but fuck me, dull. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Like, what I want to speak to is I want to speak to people who look like they are, like, ex-smackheads. So we'll get to you two in a minute. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, people who look like they're having a laugh, but they could fucking kick off at any moment. I mean, what's he going to do? I think you'll find that this was out of order. <laughs> um, so, quick name. Chris. Like, where are you from? Chester. Harrogate. Uh, fucking exactly. <laughs> Fuck, that's what I'm. I'm so working class. I can fucking sniff out middle class people. From uh, I'm like a fucking Jack Russell, like a ratter. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Where are they? Where are they? I'm from, I'm from, I'm from Harrogate, and I actually have my own consultancy as well. Uh, what's the deal behind you, Chris? Where, uh, what are you doing in Harrogate? <laughs> You're a chef. Oh right, okay. But I bet it's going to be at some sort of upper class wanky restaurant <laughs> kind of place where they call chicken nuggets goujons <laughs> uh, <laughs> we all know it don't we we're all going fucking eight quid they serve it on a piece of slate the cunts uh, what's, what's his wanky restaurant called what sorry the crab and lobster oh <laughs> fuck off the crab and lobster, shit me. Well, I mean, is it just crab and lobster that you serve there? No? Right, well, how much? Uh, everyone apart from vegans. Well, we're on the same page then, they can fuck off. Uh, so, so <laughs> look at a vegan that's trying to get the fucking protein to be offended by that. Oh, I would be offended, but I'm so tired. Um, so, it's all right. Uh, uh, so you got you got the you got the crab and lobster. Okay. Uh, uh, so so starters. How much are starters? Uh, seven to ten pounds. Seven to ten for starters. That's main course price, isn't it? <laughs> that's that's a main price. How much how much is a main? Fifty. And people ballers have full lobsters. <laughs> Shit. Can you pick them out in a tank? Really? I thought they did that in fancy restaurants. Oh, right, okay. That's, that's kind of disappointing, that, isn't it? <laughs> Am I the only person that's... You've heard of that, haven't you? Like, you, you go into a fancy restaurant, and they have loads of lobsters, like, swimming around in a tank, and you go, oh, I want that one, and you, you feel like, God... Um... <laughs> Do you know what I mean? You look, you look at all the lobsters in the eyes, and you go, have you got kids? I'm fucking having you. <laughs> In the pot you go, and these little lobster families crying, and you go, I'm fucking eating your dad. <laughs> and that's why you pay extra, because you feel like a big man, because you're killing an animal. It's, uh, it's just a fact, isn't it? I look at the vegan going, yes, yes. <laughs> Damn right, Freddie, you've made a right good point. Um, how, much, how much are desserts? Six weeks, seven. That's kind of like an afterthought, really, isn't it? It's, uh, so did you do like a three-course menu at a certain price? Lunch is three courses for 20 quid. That's still a bit much. That's like Munro price, isn't it? It's fucking dear. Okay. Where is it? Is it like in, uh, like, you know, like a lovely, luxurious grounds or something like that? No, they've got a hotel on the same site. They've got a hotel on the same site as well. And big gardens and stuff. That's very fancy. <laughs> Sounds like the perfect place for a fourth date. <laughs> <laughs> she could have crab and lobster but I'm having fish fingers <laughs> <laughs> oh my god I feel like such a fat perv <laughs> and I fucking am uh, <laughs> sweet so you're a, you're a fancy ass chef at some fucking restaurant for cunts uh what about you, number, man number two who's got his arms folded and now his arms covering his penis? That was a weird fucking... <laughs> that was a weird chat. Nipples and dick, that's what I'm about. Uh, name? Stuart. Stuart, good stuff, Stuart. And Harrogate as well, Stuart? Yeah, 
course you are. Well, are you, are you all from Arrogant then? No, look at you. Are you the working class bloke they keep around so they feel better about themselves? <laughs> this is John, he's a builder. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> I'm right thick, but they seem lovely. <laughs> I'm <laughs> fucking Lenny at the fucking end. Fucking mice and men here. Um, <laughs> sweet. Okay, we got two Georges and a man who fucking kills the rabbits. Um, <laughs> look at everyone remembering their GCSE English. <laughs> Go, yes, yeah, so what a book. What a great book. Um, so, uh, uh, Stuart, wasn't it? Uh, what's the deal behind you then, lad? What are you doing? You, you buy property and develop it and then sell it on a profit thus hiring the property market and making it less affordable for real people to... Uh... <laughs> cool, that's, that's a pretty nice job, isn't it, mate? It's pretty nice. Pretty good of you. I am just getting a mortgage at the moment. Do you know how much they would let me have a mortgage for, mate? 86 grand. That's how much I'm allowed. <laughs> they looked at me and they were like, we're not giving you any money. <laughs> you look, you're a comedian, are you? No, get out, get out, lad. <laughs> so how many properties have you got then, Stuart? You don't keep them? No, why, why would you, mate? Just, just sell them on for more. Uh, what do you specialise in? You buy flats, houses? New builds. So they've just been fucking built. <laughs> and you, how much renovation is required in a new build? You literally walk in and go, yep, this is done. This, just going to hold on to it for a year and profit like the fucking devil that I am. Um, that's all right. Sweet. How much do you make from property development? Depends. Depends on the property. De depends what the tax man takes. Okay, and I'm guessing you lot from Harrogate, that's as little as fucking possible. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I lost money this year. <laughs> uh, sweet, okay. So, so cool. So, uh, so we've got two, two middle class lads. It's all right, you know, we're only... You, you fucking are middle class. <laughs> you shut the fuck up right now, lads. You're not, you're not allowed to identify with the same background that I do. Not a fucking chance. Have you ever been on holiday to Centre Parks? <laughs> yes, that's the most middle class thing in the world, dickhead! <laughs> I once went on holiday to my nan's house. She didn't even live far away. She was about 15 minutes away. <laughs> Fucking nonsense. I'm middle class. Shut the fuck up. I only realised that I was poor as a kid when I went round to other people's kids' house for fucking food. Do you know what I mean? Like when I went round to, the, when I went round to like another kid's house for tea, and I was like, "Fuck!" As if like you, you you've got chicken that's not from a packet. What the fuck, mate? Uh, sweet. Okay. So you're. Where did you grow up? All oh, right. Okay. Near Middlesbrough. That you you fucking putting in your scum old credentials here, aren't you? Uh, what sort of house? What sort of house did you have? Council house? Oh, right, okay. What did your mum and dad do? Uh, dad's dead. Your dad's dead? <laughs> but that's not... That's, no. What were you all fucking ooing at? <laughs> like I fucking checked the Sedgefield obituary column before I came on tonight, and I was like, I fucking got that, chef. If he says anything... Um, that's... No, no, I mean... I mean, when I said, what does he... Why did you say... When I said, what, what did he do? And you said, he's dead. Like, that's what, like, that was his job. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> He doesn't do much net. Well, <laughs> I fucking love how brutal you are. Um, what did he do? Uh, he's done roadworks, um, kind of maintenance, painting lines, stuff like that. Painting lines? <laughs> <laughs> fucking hell, man. Painting lines. <laughs> That's your job, mate. You are painting lines. Uh, cool. And what about mum? Um, you don't know? Okay. Should we go into it? <laughs> I feel like it's going to fucking turn into an episode of Jeremy Kyle, this. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, so, so what, what, what happened? <laughs> you didn't know your mum? Oh, okay, fair enough. I'm sorry to hear that. So we got three acts on in this next section. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking, do you know what? I fucking loved how you sort of... There was a game of chicken between me and you. And you sort of went, yeah, go on, make a joke out of it, you fat cunt. 
I just panicked. Sweet. What's the deal? What's the deal behind you, Dead Quick? You you a nurse from where? Northwest Ambulance, you see? Fucking middle, middle working. Called it! Good for you, lads! That's fantastic. How, how long have you been a nurse for? 12 years. Good on you, pal. That's, that's not, we're not even taking the piss out of you because you're doing a bloody good job, God bless you. Is it general nurse or anything nurse yeah, yeah, specific? You used to work in, My missus works in mental health at the moment. It's, uh, it's fucking bad, isn't it? Yep. Getting worse. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like we've... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do you know what? Like, whenever you three throw me a dead end with your fucking brilliant job or your fucking dead dad, I've got to, like, move over here now, haven't I? And go, oh, you're fingering each other. And then you just fucking move on. Shit in hell. Okay. Well, this has been fun. Um, holy shit, that was weird, wasn't it? Uh, I enjoyed that though. I enjoyed how you just sort of met me, met me gaze and just made it fucking happen. <laughs> fucking Stu's not even blinked yet, has he? <laughs> just, he's just looking at me in the eye going, I'm going to get that fucking property that you've put a mortgage down on. <laughs> I'm going to develop it and make you not afford it, you fat homeless cunt. That's, um... 